Blake Shelton surprised at being named People's Sexiest Man Alive. Blake Shelton was named Sexiest Man Alive by People magazine, a first for any country singer, prompting the voice judge to shake off his shyness about his looks. I've been ugly my whole life, Shelton, 41, said in a statement on Tuesday. If I can be sexy for a year, I'm taking it. But the first thing on Blake's mind was his The Voice co-star and playful show rival Adam Levine, who was named Sexiest Man Alive by the same publication in 2013. I can't wait to shove this up Adam's ass, Shelton declared. As proud as I am and honored that you guys asked me, that's really the only thing I care about. Oklahoma native Shelton spent a decade in country music before his popularity surged in 2011 as the wisecracking judge and mentor to aspiring singers on NBC's reality singing competition show The Voice. His most recent album, Texama Shaw, was released earlier this month. Shelton told People he could not wait to tease his fellow The Voice judge and Maroon 5 frontman Levine with his new Sexiest Man Alive title. I'm not going to treat this like Hugh Jackman or one of those guys who's humble about it. People are going to hate me over this, Shelton joked. Shelton was formerly married to country singer Miranda Lambert and has been dating pop singer Gwen Stefani, 48, for the past two years. He told People that Stefani had encouraged him to accept the title of Sexiest Man Alive. She goes, listen to me, recalled the six-foot-five Oklahoma-bred Shelton. You're going to regret this for the rest of your life if you don't take this gift and just live in the moment. Previous title holders include Dwayne, The Rock, Johnson, Brad Pitt, George Clooney, Johnny Deep, Harrison Ford, Ryan Reynolds and David Beckham. The Voice announced Shelton being named Sexiest Man Alive at the start of Tuesday's episode in a segment also featuring Levine. Levine joked that it was good development since he only talks to other Sexiest Man Alive title holders. The magazine's Sexiest Man Alive special double issue hits newsstands on Friday. Growing up, Shelton told people he had some awkward years. I think to describe myself as a child, one word comes to mind. And that's fat, he said. People say I haven't changed since before I made it. And I'm still fat today. That's proof. He's not, of course. He hops on the treadmill to stay in shape, though he acknowledges the allure of chips and dip, a bag of Cheetos when he's starving and a trip to Sonic when he's back home in Tishomingo, Oklahoma. People's Choice of Shelton received mixed reviews on social media. Twitter user Gen C posted, Blake Shelton is people's sexiest man alive because apparently Idris Elba, Chris Evans and Jason Momoa fell off the planet last night. Others vented on social media that Charlie Hunnam, Tree Vandy Rhodes and the cast of Black Panther should have won the title. The choice was also lambasted by some upset over old tweets by Shelton they deemed racist, homophobic and misogynistic. If you haven't noticed Richard Simmons is gay, you haven't noticed Katy Perry's sick boobs, read one Shelton tweet in October 2009. Another from June 2009 read, I'm not gay but I think Ellen is hot. Wait a minute. What? Shelton later apologized for the tweets in a statement that read, Everyone knows comedy has been a major part of my career and it's always been out there for anyone to see. That said, anyone that knows me also knows I have no tolerance for hate of any kind or form. Can my humor at times be inappropriate and immature? Yes. Hateful? Never. The country star wasn't the only sexiest man anointed. The magazine named the Pearson men of NBC's This Is Us as sexiest cast. Sterling K. Brown, who plays Randall. Milo Ventimiglia, who plays Jack. And Justin Hartley, who plays Kevin. The trio will be featured inside this special issue.